very good candidates and um, a candidate which had uh, done our course about three months back. But after the course, once she did not make it and I was quite shocked because in the class I found her attention, her participation was par excellence. Right? So I was generally shocked that how can this happen? But there must have been something, the assessors, but she proved it, right? And on 18th January, 2022, uh, Roshna George, she cracked the SSB from 33 SSB Bhopal for Naval Architecture. She's an engineer and I think for her, this would be probably one of the best opportunities to serve the Navy. Okay. So now I've invited her today to uh, share with us her experiences of SSB, how she prepared, like a lot of students in between the month of September, October, we started the two days offline. So they had come, but uh, Roshna could not come for offline because she was in uh, down South in Chennai and places, which was not possible that time to come and attend uh, the offline for the two days, but she learned everything like you guys are here. So that's the reason I invited her, that how did she utilize the pure online platform in understanding the concepts and then putting them on the ground. So uh, may I invite uh, Roshna George now uh, to you know, tell us what was her experience? How did she prepare for the SSB? Roshna? Yes, sir. Good evening, sir. Good First evening. of all, a very good evening to Afsana, ma'am, all the uh, teachers and all the uh, as, all the uh, teachers here. And I'm so happy to back again, again, the online mode. Uh, so, yes, sir. So it was a very good experience uh, and uh, learning online was a bit difficult, but I, uh, with your, uh, with your guidance and suggestions, we could make it. So thank you so much for that, sir. So um, uh, let's take us uh, back to uh, how did you prepare, let's say uh, one month before the SSB, what did you revise? How did you revise? And then, then take us to the PPDT where everybody's anxious here. How did you handle PPDT, right? Okay. 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 So, uh, sir, firstly, I decided that um, I'll go, I'll decide my plan and um, make a routine for myself. Starting with the routine is the most important thing, as you had mentioned to us. We always maintain a routine and follow that particularly. So, uh, for before one month itself, uh, I had started watching various news channels and I was following uh, Amos and through YouTube and Instagram. I used to watch, uh, sir used to put several news, uh, news, important news and all of that. So I used to make a note of it. And as sir had, um, you know, guided us to make few diaries, like the data entry diary and the lecture diary and the, um, the news diary, which we have to prepare. I maintained it intact even after my coaching. So, uh, the news and everything was well prepared and for the one month before one month of my ssb i segregated my preparation as as of key i prepare for two weeks for my interview and the next two weeks i uh, completely give it for oir and psych and i'll revise all the uh, interview questions whatever ci i had written down all the ciqs in a paper as sir had told us so i had written in detail like whatever uh, the assessor is going to ask me i was ready that whatever you ask, I, I was uh, uh, very much prepared for that because I had it in written. So I was revising along with Spike and OIR. So, and this was my pre preparation about uh, the Psych right. and yeah. And yes. uh, how about uh, uh, the, when you joined uh, the SSB, when you reached there, first thing yes. was OIR and PPGT. Yes. How did you tackle it on the first day? How many students were there? What kind of environment was there? Yes, sir. Yeah, uh, so, so a total of one, around 110 girls reported and 33 of them got screened in. And um, at the final day, uh, four of uh, them got recommended. Uh, like I was one among them. So, um, and PPDT, for PPDT, we had a picture in which like three uh, male and one female candidate were standing and they were discussing on particular list. The female had a list in her hand. So that was the picture. And the discussion as it was a repeater's batch, so I was a bit anxious, like what would it be uh, as a repeater? How would my experience be? So we all, it started off with a fish market. I was not able to speak, but I maintained my uh, calmness and I sat down and I just waited for that chance where everyone was quiet. 
so i just waited i was looking at everyone's mouth ki when are, when are they going to keep quiet and then i'll take that chance so oh, i was able, strategy <laughs> yeah <laughs> then okay. uh, i just uh, spoke for two three times sir but i was very calm and composed that's what i uh, you know um, observed everyone who was shouting were, were not recommended <laughs> so yeah so that happened and oir was almost very similar to that which i got in my bangalore almost similar some of the okay. questions were different the usual verbal and non verbal portion so yeah that's about after that how was the psych test next day yeah uh, yes sir the psych test tat was a bit difficult in bhopal for everyone i asked the previously recommended candidates and the ongoing uh, ongoing candidates who were you know going on with their ssbs so tat was a bit difficult because most of the pictures were neutral sir uh, if it was a negative or a positive picture we could have easily made it mm -hmm. the stories but most of them had a single lady sitting on a chair just that no background uh, we couldn't make out but that whether it is a town or a nothing was uh, yeah so that was a, a bit difficult but uh, vat were normal words srt was also mostly mm -hmm. related to convincing parents and all of that and yeah that so i you completed to... uh, all the 11 pictures without any problem you could write no, enough yes sir i was masala able to into that <laughs> yes sir all uh, the innovative all the ideas filled yes sir <laughs> yeah, as good. sir had told us ki masala is what matters the aloo inside yeah. the samosa is what matters <laughs> okay. so we had done that yeah. and that none of you uh, you left no word i hope uh, i missed one word sir one at word. the end i was not able to catch it because yeah yeah so, you forgot uh, that word maybe Yeah. Yeah. I and SRT is how many you did? Sir, SRT is I could do forty eight this time. That's a good number. That's a reasonably yes. good number. Yes. Okay. So uh, when was the interview after Psych or after GTO? Uh, after Psych, sir. So actually, okay. they had called me. Uh, they were making repeaters wait a lot. I don't know why. So Crazy. all the entire batch of repeaters were uh, waiting for long. So I was called at twelve, and my oh. interview was done by four thirty. Oh. so i was waiting in that interview hall like very i at the end by the end i was very stressed how is it going to be and then i entered and the interviewing officer was not smiling he was very serious because it's already 4:30 and he's tired he so tired. i just went in with a smiling face and i just didn't stop smiling so that mm. i don't you know irritate him or something yeah. like that mm -hmm. so i felt that Good. i should smile yeah. so i was continuously smiling but he was yawning he was you know keeping out <laughs> his spectacles on the table and okay very very less oh, interest starting for them also you know so yes like, sir i completely understand because mm -hmm. he was sitting till 5:30 there so. okay. and so, my interview lasted for like 40 minutes okay. and uh, he started with he didn't ask me any ciq uh, okay. he directly started with my ssb preparation what okay. did you lack in your last ssb uh, where did you you know miss out what, what happened roshna he asked so i was like sir i feel these are my weaknesses so i completely dedicated my 3 months in that preparation and i was constantly improving my personality so he is like okay how did you improve your personality so he was picking up each and every statement which i was telling okay especially parents questions sir he asked me uh, what all qualities would you like to change okay. so when i was telling the qualities he was picking up like how why when did you do that and why did you means how do you do that in your family so all okay. questions were picked up mm -hmm. then my education technical background uh, many questions and mm -hmm. that to uh, not um, the theory portion but the calculation portion okay. that was asked mostly mm -hmm. and he asked me to um, he asked the dimensions of the room in which we were sitting and then he asked me to convert it into mm -hmm. feet and then inches and then he also asked me like since i was a civil engineer so he asked me uh, what is the current cement rate uh, these things we have practiced in the class so i think you should have yes. you have to handle that no uh, yes sir the calculation uh, question yeah have, and uh, already uh, sir as you had mentioned to us ki you have to maintain the data diary in which you yeah. have to keep so that was very helpful because okay. i always kept those points in mind which you told us in class and yeah. all of that helped Okay. i'm uh, telling all of you that please make note of whatever sir tells you uh, just make note of it and follow mm -hmm. that as it is it is going to work <laughs> yes okay so how was the gto then 
Sir, GTO, to, sir, as you had told us, everything I followed, what GTO is expecting okay. from us and uh, how to perform, how to react. Sir, one peculiar thing which I noticed was GTO had, uh, GTO interacted with me for like 10 to 15 minutes. Like before the command he, task? Yes, sir. Before the command mm -hmm. task, he interacted me for long. So that happened. Uh, so mm -hmm. he complete interview, like the personality, why Navy, why not Army? Since okay. he was from army, so all those questions were, mm. uh, those came up. And then uh, in command task, uh, he uh, asked me to complete one course. And then he's like, the entire structure is broken now. Mm, Move yeah. to the next. Yeah. Then again, he's like, what is this Roshna? Uh, this is not how commanders do do it properly. Mm. Then uh -huh. I was doing it, sir. Because I was taking a bit of time. In he the was third putting time. little stress on you. So yes, to see your reaction. Yeah. Too much, sir. Too much. So okay. I was, Great. yeah. So you are able yes, to sir. understand uh, the online basically uh, my only doubt was that though I teach everything with the help of models and other things with the online sir, course sir, that you didn't have time yes, to sir. cover offline. So were you able to remember all that? Put yes sir. Practice. So uh, actually um, in online class we all were made given points and we were shown the actual uh, miniature structures of those uh, obstacles which we receive in our class. So, uh, and you asked us to draw it also. So, while drawing it was completely imprinted in our minds that this is how it is going to be. So, I don't know how it is in the practical ground, but it was very well imprinted in my mind that this is the structure and this is what you have to do. So, all I had drawn, I used to refer it regularly and even the videos from YouTube channel. So, everything was very helpful. So, I just kept that Falkram ka concept in mind. That's okay. all. Which that you used to, to tell us. We had to teach them. The next yes. week you will come through. That. Okay. Okay, sir. Okay. So overall, uh, uh, what tip would you like to give to the aspirants now who are sitting in the class 16 years batch? Okay. Yes, sir. So one thing is that just believe whatever it is online or offline. Online, I had completed through online. I, I give you the assurance that uh, whatever sir is telling you is, is everything. You don't have to go beyond that. So... Through online classes, uh, the pictures, the images, the structures, whatever is shown, just note it down. Follow uh, regularly. Be regular. Make a routine. The first step is just make a routine and believe in yourself that you can do it. It's nothing that you won't be able to do it. It's nothing is impossible. Just believe in yourself and just be confident. Be smiling while the interview. And, and the other two things you have said is uh, regarding the you know decorate booklet, which we have told them to start making. Today, in fact, yes. we'll be telling them. And yes, data area force, uh, you kept updating. That was very useful. Uh, interview yes. preparation, uh, you went with full preparation. What uh, SP Sir had covered the CAQs. Yes. Though sir. we not have directly asked it, but indirectly those yes, are the questions indirectly. only. Yes. Uh, which mm -hmm. are asked. Right. Some people freshers they will ask directly. Repeaters they may twist it here and there. And psych uh, uh, was little challenge, I think, for you. Yes, only the cat ones. Cat, cat was a bit slightly bit. different pictures came. Sometimes it yes. happened. Yes. Okay, now friends, uh, uh, we will not take more time because she also has to get back to her job. Uh, what I would uh, open up now is any questions anybody wants to ask for another five minutes, we'll open the class in the which anybody wants to ask any question, you can ask any question to Roshna. People keep asking me on Instagram, can we, can you get her live and all that? I generally say no. But here in the class, you can ask questions. Sure. Yeah. Anybody wants to ask anything specifically? Okay, uh, Chirag has raised his hand first. Chirag, what's your question for you? Congratulations, Roshna. Thank you. Uh, I want to know about how do you prepare for psych? Like when I'm starting right now, I think it's too bad. Okay. You, the story, sir gave a story and it is not written in the four or five lines just. Okay, so <laughs> the thing is, as I mentioned, I had kept complete two weeks for my psych. So I made sure that each and every day, as sir tells us, that uh, each and every day you practice at least two stories, two random stories uh, or whatever the booklet is provided to us. Those random stories, 10 words and then 10 SRTs. I used to make it a habit and that too time bound. I used to keep the timer on and I used to practice. So that helped me a lot, even though the first first day won't be a good one. But as you pass like three to four days, you can see uh, and you have to keep, make sure that you're following all the points which uh, our psychologists tell us. Like, sir, 
gives us each and every point what you have to follow right like in that you have to be positive and then in that what you have to follow all those you have to keep in mind and start writing so then you can easily do it practice every day at least two weeks before uh the ssb continuous uh, uh, chirag once we are class and practice is chal rahi hai iske baad we will send you a worksheet what she is referring yes. they yes. all you will all receive a worksheet and we have uh, let and like two pics per day you can do there about 20 15 20 pictures there so that's enough how much kitna bada practice hai jhoot bhi nahi okay yeah vivek what's your question vivek what's your question oh, yes sir Yeah. Uh, ma'am being a repeater what all problems do you face in uh, ppt discussion and uh, um, how you overcome them yeah so in uh, ppdt as well as in gd it was a fish market as it was a repeaters batch and it was a girls batch to be hi- highlighting that fact because girls always want to speak and they don't keep quiet so uh, that at that point you have to just wait for everyone to keep quiet when one person is talking there will be a point where she is going to stop or he is going to stop so mm-hmm. keep that point in mind by practicing itself i um, was you know practicing in the classes itself in online classes i was waiting for a person who is speaking to stop and i used to make sure that i get that chance so always wait for that chance there will be a 2 or 3 second break in between the talks yeah, so right, make sure good. Shikha, what do you want to ask? Uh, as ma'am, you mentioned that uh, uh, you were asked a question: Why Navy? Why not Army? I want uh, like how smartly you handle that. I want to listen the answer actually. See, it's completely a personal question. Firstly, but I would like to share my answer is that I told them that it's not about the forces which I'm working; it's about the service which I'm do- doing to my nation. So whether it be Army, Air Force. uh indian navy whatever it is i i be the same person in all the three services my yeah. emotions would be the same so incidentally she is daughter of a army officer but she is now gone to navy because anyway in the new next battlefield you have all heard of yes. unification of the battlefield right what cds is doing so yes. whether it is army navy it's all going to be theater commands exactly. so the same theater will have army navy air force all the three So this also you can incorporate in your answer, Shikha. Yes. Okay, last question from Bhavya. Yes, sir. Uh, congratulations, ma'am. Ma'am, my question uh, from you is that what went different for you from the previous attempt when you were recommended uh, to that now you were recommended? Yeah. First of all, thank you so much. And then uh, the the problem which I faced in my last interview was uh, last SSB was interview actually. So I was. maybe uh, he asked me a lot of gk questions so one of that and especially some questions related to uh, the current at that time the international uh, tokyo olympics was going on so related to that i was not able to you know be to the point the answer was not to the point so mm-hmm. i made sure that i am practicing all the current affairs and everything regularly more uh, in a more uh, effective way in a more mm-hmm. precise way mm-hmm. Yeah, so you have to make sure that your current affairs is very strong. Uh, um, I won't say that wait for the class to get over. From today itself, start the homeworks which you are given, which we were given. Uh, I used Anna, to follow it. I would be it. very happy to hear this remark of yours. <laughs> But she keeps banging the head every day morning, and they are not even prepared. <laughs> Because uh, she, I agree, sir. I agree. Thank you, ma'am. It was a huge help, ma'am. Because uh, now I realize why. Uh, you know afsana ma'am arjun sir used to keep telling us do the homework complete the homework because that all of these things matters so that's what that's what will take you to recommendation i'm sure thank, thank you, you so ma'am. much and uh, it was nice to see you again in the classroom and the same <laughs> smiling face which you had here thank before you, recommendation and you maintained it during ssb and even after recommendation god bless you Thank you and so much. And soon uh, wish to see you in white uniform joining yes, Azamullah. Yes, sir. Sure, sir. Right. And, sure, uh, sir. Next wishes. You can uh, now join back. Thanks for taking out time, half an hour for. It's not an issue, sir. Not not at all a problem, sir. Any time, sir. Thank, Thank you so much. Best wishes. Thank you so much. Right, Jai.